with Escape Games Global, Alona and Mason. Aww. We just did Diamond Heist at MindQuest. What do you think? I love this game. It is very cool. Yeah. Tell you a little bit about the story. There is a cartel. There is a diamond. It was stolen. We're in the office of the cartel. Aww. And we have trashed it. We have anarchically, we just went through and just tossed it. This is no relevance to the game. We haven't even played it yet. We just threw things all about because we thought it was a good decorative choice. She especially. This is how our house looks. <laughs> no. Yeah. So, um, anyway, uh, as far as the scenic, what did you think of the scenic and the decorations? No typing. Yeah. I, I, I love okay. it. I, I really love this room. I, I think it's uh, all right. Perfect. Like, I see a lot of room and I really like this one. Yeah, I, I think that, you know, as far as office rooms go, because that is that is the, the the setting, is office rooms. Um, you know, you, to have the room, it, it's one of those things, office rooms never feel alive. They just feel cold and stagnant, you know. No music accompanying, no flickering lights, whatever. So, you know, it's, it's a pretty custom area office room um, overall. Does get a little bit more interesting, but you know, well, it's fine. We can say that. I got, I got, I can say this. I got. Okay. So anyway, but it does get a little bit more interesting. Um, but overall, the you know the, the scenic was expectory. I, I didn't think like it. It made me feel like this is a hardcore office space, but it doesn't have to. That's not the job. You know. What did you think of the puzzles? Oh, I love the puzzle because for me it was really understandable. From the first when I come in the room, I really understand what I'm supposed to do. I know what's really, ah, uh, where, what, like, when yeah. you find one, you understand what is the second one, third one, mm -hmm. like, it's really, who, who, what is the, the right of who you both? Is this the part where you forget what language we're actually speaking? Uh, I think it is. All right. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> no, the... The one thing that's probably the coolest thing about this room is the puzzles do flow fantastically well. I believe that the group should come in the room and solve the puzzle within the first five minutes because that kind of gets the motivated a little bit rolling. And you, you know, hopefully that should happen with you. Um, you need to tell the group it's better when it's non big group. Yeah, so. it's definitely a smaller group is, is best. This isn't a super hardcore room, the success rate is probably a little higher. We comfortably finished it with two, and I wouldn't say we're the most competent players in the world. But, you know, like, <laughs> but overall, like, it, it flowed very well. You know, the puzzles were good. We had a good time. Um, when it came down to, I'd say the only, the only critique I have, like, and it's a constructive critique. Why are you typing again? You I don't need your typing. It I'm, doesn't work. It's not plugged in. I'm just plugged Why? in. Why? It's going to be okay. But we had to do math. And since I'm notoriously stupid, math does not bode well for us. Historically, have you noticed that every single one we've done yes. that has math, we do terribly on? Have you noticed that? Because you every time confused. Well, look at me, I confuse. <laughs> Why you let me do it? That's like saying we get lost all the time. Because well, I'm when the one you driving, see the pen, and you're the one. Is math. that the point? When you see the pen, you're just thinking you need to write. What? <laughs> oh, this is going to turn into marriage counseling really quick, I'm sure. But, so nonetheless, um, we, uh, I, I, I like the puzzles. Like I said, they flowed well. It's nothing um, there, so you don't need to strip that. Just in case you wanted to circumvent the game master, alone will now tell you the rules of the game. Also tell them they shouldn't break things. Yeah, you don't need to break nothing. The picture's non, no, it's just decoration that is piece of puzzle, but it's nothing under that. That's very helpful. I know. And so overall fun factor, what did you think? Well fun factor. Yes. Yeah, awesome. I really like it. Cool. Were you, were you happy you escaped? Huh? Were you happy you escaped? Yeah. Yeah. So I mean there's a big diamond, maybe, possibly. Yeah. Everybody can see the my pictures with diamond in their Facebook. Oh that's true, yes. You you are renowned for finding a diamond. I'm very proud of you by the way. Mm. Um, you know, in, in addition to all the actual in game details. The location of MindQuest is uh, there's a nice uh, there's a nice burger joint right next door. Um, and when you finish the game, you could have discount to eat. Yeah, you can actually uh, you can get a discount um, at Best Burgers. But overall, it's a good place to go. Uh, it's it's a nice safe place. Uh, you don't have to worry about creepy people lurking outside um, unless it's alone. P P P. 
Pew, 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 pew. Yes, what is that? Pew, 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 pew. Oh, don't you talk to me about pronunciation. <laughs> like, this is not going to go well for you. I just want to... Asparagus. That's asparagus. Translated from a moment. Anyways, nonetheless, that's our review. Would you like to tell them not to break anything else? What? what? No. no. I just want to say thank you, Ina and Lee. Mm -hmm. Ina and Lee are the owners, and they're awesome. And uh, we hope that you will visit MindQuest because it was very fun. Yeah. So that's Diamond Heist, and we look forward to telling you more about some of the other games that they have. Why don't we give a kiss? <laughs>